All right. ABC 27's Jada Williams is live at Lee Hall on FAMU's campus. Jada, why another sentencing for the bomber? Well, Ava, uh, Lawrence Lombardi was sentenced again because in his initial sentencing, uh, the, a court case from last year threw out two of those charges. Now, Lombardi was convicted of planting two pipe bombs on FAMU's campus. He worked on FAMU's campus, but in 1999, he decided to go in and put in those bombs. Now, while Lombardi's attorney says that she's disappointed in the ruling, FAMU's president says it's exactly what he wanted to hear. Dr. Larry Robinson and another FAMU staff member spoke out about that day in the sentencing hearing, both saying the racial attack sent waves of fear throughout the campus for years. Leon County Commissioner Bill Proctor was also on campus that day. He's a professor at FAMU as well and says that he's glad current students aren't living in the horror that he saw back in 1999. It's a good thing that they don't remember those things because it meant they did not experience them. And so by Lombardi staying in jail, hopefully that's one less guy who has a track record of proving that that's what he will do. I didn't expect 54 years. That, that in effect is a life sentence. I'm disappointed for him. You know, I hope that he has another chance within a reasonable period of time. And you just heard from Lombardi's attorney. He did speak out in court. He expe expressed regret for what he did and says that he has changed and learned to embrace people of every culture since going to prison. Now, Lombardi does have 34 years left on his sentence. That means that by the time he's released from prison, he'll be 96 years old. Reporting live from Lee Hall, Jada Williams, ABC 27.